education in the broadest sense is any act or experience that has a formative effect on the mind, character or physical ability of an individual. Society transmits its accumulated knowledge and skills through a system of formal education. Importance of education could never be overstated. However, wouldn't it be more exciting and fruitful if we could learn to learn and not to pass exams? Wouldn't it be great if we could learn what we wanted to learn and not what the curriculum dictated? Think of the immense opportunities and freedom one can attain to alternate education. Today, I, Shreya Adarsh of Class 11 of Rajagiri Jeeva CMI Central School, would like to talk to you on the increasing acceptance of education and homeschooling. What prompts parents to shift to homeschooling? Today's young parents are increasingly involved in their child's learning and development. Rigidity of the formal school curriculum worries them. Wouldn't it be unforgivable if a child who is an exceptional artist who can be the next Subalakshmi or M.F. Hussain is forced to learn regular school subjects from morning till evening and has a leftover time to pursue his or her special talents? Wouldn't it be unforgivable if a child who shows exceptional learning in science is categorized as an average student based on the average marks received by him in other subjects? Understanding this and understanding the power of associative and conceptual learning have prompted many families to adopt alternate education for their children. US is a pioneer in homeschooling with about 2.3 million children pursuing education under this method. Although in India it is in a very nascent state, homeschooling is slowly gaining popularity with a small minority of families shifting from exam obsessed mainstream school system to providing their children individualized primary and secondary education at home. Homeschooling caters to individual child's aptitudes and developments, helps to provide more challenging materials for gifted students and also helps them to work at their own pace. Children learn best when they are encouraged to question, investigate and research. According to a study conducted by NASA in 2017, at the age of 3, 98% of children are creative. But by the time they reach the age of 15, only 2% remain creative. Homeschooling offers immense opportunities to develop one's creative and cognitive capabilities. If we look back into history, it would be surprising to know that many, many creative minds like Albert Einstein, Thomas Alva Edison, Agatha Christie, etc. were homeschooled. Although homeschooling is an enjoyable and enriching learning experience, educating children at home is no joyride. It requires extraordinary investment in terms of time, dedications, patience and relearning capabilities of the parents. It also requires sourcing of good study materials for their children. With the World Wide Web having transformed into an instantly accessible storehouse of knowledge, creativity, critical thinking and problem solving have become the prerequisites for success. I strongly believe that customized learning and homeschooling will equip the children to be better prepared for the new age. We don't want factory made products which are all created out of the same mold. We want a generation of individuals who have their unique capabilities honed by education. As George Evans, the American cartoon said, every student can learn, just not on the same day or in the same way. Thank you.